to program or code Dash at the robot, the Path app is a great place to start for students in K-3. You'll find it on the iPads that come with the kit, or if you're using a school iPad, it's a free download from the App Store. Use the search function in the App Store in the top right hand corner to find Path for Dash. You will need an internet connection to add a new app to your iPad. To connect Dash the Robot to your iPad, make sure the Bluetooth is turned on. When you've launched the Path for Dash app on your iPad, press the plus button at the top right hand corner of the screen to connect to your robot. If more than one robot in the room is turned on, select any of them, then click the orange settings button and set your chosen robot to a specific color so you know which one is yours. The light on the side of their head will change to your chosen color. To start creating commands for Dash to execute, tap the orange square, then tap the arrow. You're presented with a bird's eye view of Dash and the floor space on which he can move. You can use your fingers to pinch and zoom if you need more floor space to plan your path. Use one finger on the iPad to start tracing your path for Dash to follow. Start by pressing on the robot, then move your finger across the canvas. Once you let go, the path is ready and a single tap on Dash will execute the program. To delete the path, tap the red circle with the X. Once you've traced a path, the toolbar at the bottom of the screen will allow you to add objects to the program for Dash. Simply drag from the toolbar and drop onto the path. Add a pause, use the slider to set the time. Tap the background to get your toolbar back. Add an audio clip for Dash to play. Either use a pre-recorded one or use a mic to create your own. If the students wish to add more features, they need to unlock the challenges that are built into the app. 